Once upon a time, there were three little pigs who lived with their mother. One day, it was time for the little pigs to leave home and build their own houses. The little pigs couldn't wait to build their own houses, so they set off happily on their journey. As they walked along the road, the little pig soon came across a man with a cart filled with straw. This is the best building material, said the first little pig. So, after a day of hard work, the first little pig had built himself a fine house made of straw. The two other little pigs looked at his house and thought that they could do better, so they continued down the road. A little further along the road, the two little pigs met a man with a cart loaded with sticks. This is the best building material, said the second little pig. After a day of hard work, the second little pig had built himself a handsome house made of sticks. The last little pig looked at his house and thought that he could do better. So he waved goodbye and continued further down the road. Not much further along the road, the little pig met a man with a pickup truck filled with bricks. This is exactly what I have been waiting for. This is the best building material, said the third little pig. After weeks of hard work, the third little pig had built himself a sturdy brick house. One morning, a big bad wolf was out for a walk when he noticed the first little pig in his straw house. Little pig, little pig, let me come in, said the wolf. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin, squeaked the first little pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, growled the wolf. The wolf took a deep breath and blew down the house made of straw. The first little pig oh, ran no. as quickly as he could to the house made of sticks. <laughs> Following the first little pig, the wolf arrived at the house made of sticks. Little pigs, little pigs, let me come in, called the wolf. Not by the hairs on our chinny chin chins, quick the little pigs. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, growled the wolf. The wolf took a deep breath and blew down the house made of sticks. The two little oh, pigs no. ran as quickly as they could to the brick house. Again, the wolf followed the little pigs and reached the house made of bricks. Little pigs, little pigs, let me come in, called the wolf. Not by the hairs on our chinny chin chins, squeaked the little pigs. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, growled the wolf. But as much as it tried, the big bad wolf couldn't blow down the house made of bricks. But the wolf wouldn't give up that easily. He climbed up to the top of the house and started to squeeze down the chimney. Suddenly, the third little pig had an idea. Quickly, the three little pigs set a big pot of boiling water over the fire, just as the wolf squeezed down the chimney. The wolf fell straight into the pot of boiling water, and that was the end of him. The third little pig had outsmarted the big bad wolf and built the strongest house. He was a very clever little pig indeed.